Hey guys, my name is Ismaus. Welcome to Top 10. In this video, I want us to review the best, dopest, coolest media player ever that is VLC. It's so dope, it has its own meme. So if you go to Google right now and type in VLC meme, you will find a ton of them. Let's have a look at a few of them here. VLC media player has encountered a problem with Windows. We have other comrades for the glory of VLC, uh, Viva VLC. Uh, best weapon <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, VLC has crashed. It is the best video player ever and it has a ton of memes uh, You won't find any other media player that has memes. So if you type if you for search for say what other media player Windows media Player memes, let's see, let's see, let's see So they have a few memes, but uh, you can see even then searching for Windows media players are uh, VOC media player uh, memes come up. Uh, so you can see they're using their icon. Uh, so it's the most popular video player ever and it has a ton of features. Uh, so let's have a look at them. So if you want to download VLC, you just go to Google and type in VLC. It is made by a company called uh, Video Learn and, it's there, and their website is videolearn.org. So you just go to the first link in Google and uh, it will take you to their website. Uh, you can click on the download here, download VLC to download the application. It's about four. Uh, 40 MBs and uh, you can see how many people have downloaded it, downloaded it so far and it's about uh, 9 uh, 9 million uh, downloads and that's not including uh, people downloading the application from different <coughs> different different websites so it's the application itself is cross-platform that means that it can also be it's, it's also available on Win, it's available on windows a uh, macintosh uh linux and uh, even on your smartphone so you can find the application on your uh, android phone uh even on your uh, apple ios so yeah so you can also the the project uh video Learn is a free project it's funded by people like like us like you uh so if you want you can donate them if you don't want I, it's okay you can download the application is free and uh, so yeah after downloading uh, the application uh, you will have an exe uh, a file that you just uh, dou double click and install the setup is very s straightforward and very simple you just click next 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 until you get until you finish the installation and you have the application open up like this so yeah let's look at the application itself so to open up uh, to play back any video any video uh, you can just double click on the video and it will open up another cool thing about VOC is the only media player that has a volume bar that goes over 100 percent uh, this means that uh, if the volume on your video is a bit low uh, you can uh, slide or increase the volume up beyond 100 percent and uh, VOC will will boost that volume for you and if that's not enough you, you also have the EQ settings here down here so you, if you click on this show extended settings here it will open up uh, these adjustments and effects uh, pop-up box that lets you increase the volume to what you want it gives you some equalizer yes uh, things here uh, so you can uh, bring this up until you find uh, where you can where the volume is maximum or you can use the presets here I uh, saw so some EQ presets here if you want yeah so it gives you a ton of features that will help you uh, improve your viewing experience so yeah so so another thing about another cool thing about VOC so if your video say is a bit dark or maybe not bright enough or is too bright for you you can also go back here to uh, effects and uh, adjustments and go to video effects a uh, click uh, image adjustments here uh, to turn off to turn on the image adjustment settings and uh, you can uh, adjust whatever you can see I'm adjusting the hue and saturation I'm not sure why you would do that but uh, they give you the option uh, so you can also increase uh, or decrease the brightness uh, contrast uh, let me first bring this up you can reduce the saturation gamma a lot of things so VOC can also be used as a, as a makeshift uh, video editor so let's say let's remove these adjustments let's say you wanted to cut to record to cut out uh, this section of the clip maybe just from here from six seconds to maybe to about here 16 seconds so you can go under view uh then advanced controls and it will give you this option to record a set a part of a clip so you play back you play back 
and then hit record. And then stop. So then after, the clip will be saved in your video folder. So let's find that. So it's here. If we play back this. So we have just cut out a part of what we want and you can rename it to whatever you want. You can also take a screenshots with a VOC player. Let me get my clip again. Or let me, instead of just getting that, let me get, find another, let me show you another feature, another cool thing about VOC media player. So if I go to my favorite our website, sorry, my favorite channel, Tesla Motors, I can find a clip of anything. So maybe let's find what? let's find uh, this clip here of Elon Musk talking so you can copy the URL of the video let's copy that and come to VOC player go to media uh, open uh, network stream and you can paste the videos the video link directly into uh, the, this address bar click play and that video will start playing in your VOC media player it's still loading so let's wait for it and see the title has already come up and then uh, yeah so so my network is a bit slow but uh, yeah so you see it's already starting it's playing back right now so if i wanted to you can see the title here uh is the same title here so so say you want to record just uh, a few seconds when he starts speaking you can just hit record let's wait for him to start maybe let's just record that okay. so i recorded twice so we should sit, find two files in the video play video part so so yeah so this is the recorded part <laughs> That part. What we're unveiling today. Ah, this Minus part. Product that we worked on. So we streamed this directly from YouTube, and uh, we were able. So if you want to save a video you want, a video you want without even using a video uh, downloader, uh, a video downloader, you can use VOC. You just copy the the video URL. Let's find another clip. Maybe I will, let's find. Let's go back and find the. Let's find this. So if you want to say to download this clip without a video a downloader, you just copy the URL, come here, uh, come to VOC, let me just open a new VOC, come to VOC, go to media, open uh, network stream, and then paste directly there, then play, then you start recording. Wait for it to ro load and then you can start recording as easy as that and after you can just go back to your videos and you will find the clip there done very simple uh so another trick i can show you so if you have a video camera or a webcam you can also capture yourself directly to vlc you can go into uh open capture devices but i don't have a webcam set up right now so if but if you have one you can just select it from here from a list here uh, another cool thing about vlc vlc can be used as a video converter so let's say what do we have so uh, let's see let's see let's see so this is what format is this, this is the mp4 so let's say this is the clip we want to convert you can just go under video media uh then convert and save convert stroke save then go to we will have this open media uh pop up and then find the clip you want to convert say we want to convert this and then convert and save click on convert and save and then you'll get this convert pop-up box uh, that you can select uh from a range of formats you want uh, so you see you have mp4 i'll uh, have uh oggts they are ton of video formats so if you want just the vote the audio on the clip you can just select audio mp3 and you will get that only uh, you can also find the set other th settings here so you can check the video codec audio codec subtitles so yeah let me show you another thing so if you want to add subtitles to any clip you can just uh, go to subtitles here add subtitles and uh, you will be able to add the subtitles you want uh, so i have uh, this clip here from 
test the so if you want to add subtitles to this you can just go to uh, uh, subtitles add subtitles and you find the sub and uh, if you have the subtitle CT, uh, CRT file or any s format of subtitles you just select that and click open so now our video has subtitles this supercharging technology which is the most advanced charging See. technology in the world so that's how you this add subtitles in. you'll see again to add stop. subtitles you just go to subtitles here or just right click anywhere here and go to subtitle add subtitle and then navigate to the subtitle you want to add so yeah so another cool thing about the vlc media player is that you can open multiple uh windows of vlc say we want to have this and another windows play you just open up the clip you just open a new windows application a media player application vlc media application and then find the clip you want to open i uh, just drag it there and now you can play by tesla supercharger stations for charge your car very quickly and windows on your way. something that's unique uh, if you want to take screenshots in uh, vlc you can go directly you can find the part you want to screenshots maybe let's say this and go to, to video take screenshot the screenshot will be saved to your documents so if you find a uh, pictures documents in to your documents in pictures and then you will find uh, the screenshot there as i said before that uh, we also can be used as a makeshift video video editor uh, you can see it gives you a ton of options that uh, other application video player applications don't give you so you can if you right click anywhere in in the VOC application you get these options here so you can see the playback buttons you have the record button so uh, if you wanted to change the aspect ratio of the of the video just right click to get this menu and then go to video uh, then you should find the aspect ratio setting so you have the default uh, then if you go back you can see we have a 16 by 9 I uh, go back you can find uh, four by three cool feature is uh, about VOC is say your video is is interlaced so interlaced is when you see horizontal lines running through the video so you, if you have that you can de interlace your video by right clicking go to video and then the interlace uh, on automatic or on uh, you also have a few modes here for the interesting I also have the post processing uh, so things like that s they are small things but uh, they can be very very useful I can also have you also have the crop settings I <laughs> uh, see one by one so yeah so if you want to have your clip like this maybe let's change the aspect ratio back to default yeah you can record a clip in this aspect ratio in this uh crop so let's record and see make sure we stop so thank you for watching that was a video review of voc media player the best and coolest video player ever uh if you found this useful make sure to like subscribe and leave a like and and leave a comment and i'll see you in the next video